Welcome, welcome, welcome to Entertainment Wednesday. Quentin Tarantino, one of my all-time favorite filmmakers and screenwriters, um, he backed out of his 10th film, which is called The Movie Critic, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I believe that Quentin Tarantino, because this is his final film, I believe that he's putting a lot of pressure on himself. He wants to hit it out the ballpark. So knowing QT, he's going to come up something up his sleeve to try to really nail this movie. And I don't know. I mean, I'm curious to see what kind of movie he will make. I mean, a silent film wouldn't be so bad for a 10th film. I would like to see him doing his 10th film. That's not um, crime related or near nor heist movie i want to see him try something a little different and nail it nail it so i don't know maybe a silent film maybe some science fiction i don't know something i want to see something different from him um so he can go out with a bang supposedly brad pitt was attached or is attached to his 10th film so but whenever he's ready to make this movie, the movie theater is going to be packed. And that might be a movie that I might make my return to movie theaters. I haven't been to a movie theater since 2021 for the movie Free Guy, the Ryan Reynolds movie. So we'll see. We'll see. Because it's QT, let's see. Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman, they reunited for the 30th anniversary of one of my all-time favorite films, one of the greatest films of all time, The Shawshank Redemption. The event was hosted by Turner Classic Movies. Um, the interview, it's on YouTube, so you can check that out. And it was interesting to learn that Morgan Freeman was the one who vouched for Tim Robbins to play that Andy character. But the script was great. Um, Great written script, well directed by Frank Darab Darabont, which is one of the most impressive directorial debuts ever. Shot by the great um, Roger Deakins as the DP, which landed him his first Oscar nominee. But uh, yeah, that's what I have for you guys for today for Entertainment Wednesday. Um, and yeah, I mean, there's other news. I think Keanu Reeves, um, Al Pacino, and Dan Stevens, they're, they're coll going to collaborate on a movie, which will be fascinating. Dan Stevens, I will always remember him for his performance in The Guest, which is one of the most underrated movies of 2014. And Al Pacino, you know, the man is 80 plus years old. He just continues to work one of my all-time favorite actors um yeah he just continues to put in work thank you for watching this video please hit that thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button and as always be safe and may god bless you all